Hello there YouTube, this is Erica, the nerd who likes to film stuff with a real world review. This is really what I'm starting to call my reviews now. And start you know, saying check it out, real world reviews. Eh? So what I'd really like to discuss today is some very useful piece of information about how not to destroy your phone should you ever want to use one of these guys with one of these guys which is a micro sim adapter. So the biggest problem is that you guys, I'm not gonna, well, I'm not gonna point any fingers, but uh, you guys can all raise your hands right now. Ooh, me, me, me. Who's taken one of these guys, shoved it in their phone, gotten the gold pins stuck on it, and essentially broken their device, and uh, your car doesn't recognize it anymore, and you bend in a fetal position, and you cry because you feel like you're so retarded, you should have chopped around a little bit more. But we're not, no, I'm not pointing fingers, okay? No fingers are pointed. But the whole point is that I have found a solution for you, and I am so excited to announce. Microsimshop.com. Now, on Amazon, you can get one of these guys, you're like, whatever. I paid, I think I paid $7, I'm gonna say, for this little piece of plastic. You guys are probably laughing, pointing, saying, ha, I got mine for two cents. Two cents, and you paid $7, you stupid dummy. Well, you know what? Mine actually works and yours probably ruined your phone. And it's all because this is precision cut machined and it is not going to ruin your phone in any way at all. So what's great is that, see how it has these little notches? It actually holds the SIM card in place. So you see with these adapters, there's actually several different types of SIM card, micro SIM adapters. A lot of them you see don't have these little windows here, or these little notches, and that becomes a problem because the micro SIM can actually fall through and get stuck in your phone. And that's one of the problems. Or it can be too thick and it can push down your pins. That's another problem so that it's no longer will recognize, ooh, where, where'd it go? It, it will no longer recognize your standard SIM. And, uh, or it can just be crap and get caught, you know, on here or here as you're pulling it out of the tray. So I'm actually going to do a full demonstration for you guys. I'm going to prove it in case you don't believe me that, you know, oh, you can't use a micro SIM adapter. Even if you go somewhere like hand tech, they'll say, do not use a micro SIM adapter. It will ruin this phone. But you just got to be smart about it. So eh, nice reassuring rip. And I'm going to pull the battery out. Yes, I did turn the phone off. Wasn't doing anything important at the moment, so it should corrupt it. Alrighty, so you can see we have the standard size SIM that's just chilling in there. I'm gonna just gently slide that out. Let me show you what we're working with. You see, I'm doing this test on the Galaxy Note here, but this applies to all phones. That this is this is the stuff here. This this guy. This is what you want to use. Doesn't matter between if you want to use your iPad or you want to switch it between another phone or something else because you're just a nerd like I am and you like to switch between devices and they don't let you clone SIM cards. That's illegal. You're not allowed to do it. I'm sure it's possible, but you can't do it. So look, in here you've got this very delicate little tray and in there are these gold pins now that's a problem because they kind of just stick in here and they're just kind of laying flat yeah that's what will happen is that to these little notches here you know the little ends here will catch on that as you're pulling it out and that's what causes damage to your phone but uh, as I'm rambling here talking about how great this is this won't do that so here we are place it this way We'll focus. My lovely camera, come on, be nice to us. All the lovely people want to see. So you want to make sure that it's secure in place. I'm just going to make sure that I don't A, bend, bend the slot at all and B, that it's in there nice and snug, which it should be. That's what's so great about this little guy is that it will actually sit there snug in the tray and not fall out. So here we are. Here is my lovely unbroken Galaxy Note. You kind of want to just go at an angle here so to make sure that you get the edges in correctly. Lay it flat immediately and then push inward. And that is really all that you need to do. It's in there, nice flat. You know, this isn't going to activate because my normal SIM is the one that's uh, active right now. They turn this one off. So if you want proof that this isn't going to kill it, the best thing is to make sure your fingers aren't oily. Take your thumb and very carefully, you know, just kind of shimmy it out like so. Ta-da! All good. 
it didn't kill it, didn't break it, it still looks fantastic. And the final test, of course, is to make sure that I didn't bend down those pins. If it was too thick, it would have pushed them down, meaning that this would not be recognized anymore. So here's the final test and proof. Now the first time that I put this back in, I scared the crap out of myself because I guess I didn't push this in correctly and it didn't register and it gave me the ah, you know, symbol saying, ah, too bad, screw you. I'm not gonna find any service because you broke your SIM card slot. So here it is. It's now incorrectly. I made sure that I put it in the slot nice and neat. I'm gonna keep the back off for now and just hold that down. So, oh, hi me. Here we are. Turn it on. And as it's starting up, I'm just going to fast forward this part. You can see this nice film of grease here accumulating on the screen. I love that. It's just great. Now, alrighty. And you can see, see that? See this? This is good. See the H plus? See the reception bars? There is no cross out symbol there saying that uh, the sim isn't recognized. We are good to go. We are awesome. This is where it all is, you guys. This is, this is great, see? So you guys need to definitely go to, pushing my paper out of the way, microsimshop.com. They are located in Vienna, Austria. You want to definitely order from them. Don't go the shortcut. They are very quick about this. They even give you your own order number confirmation. If anything goes wrong, you can contact them and they'll get you another one. So seriously, please uh, rate and comment and subscribe and share this on Twitter. Let everybody know this isn't just applied to the Galaxy Note. This is for everybody who wants to use a micro SIM adapter. This is the solution, you guys. Don't get one of those cheap stupid ones that's gonna ruin your phone and make you cry, okay? So, it's, I know how you guys are. I know that your, your phones are, are like your babies and, you know, it's like the greatest piece of technology you have with you and you don't wanna break it. You don't wanna do that. So just do something so simple and tell everybody that you know to go to microsimshop.com, have them watch this video, make sure that this video gets out because I think that this is a lot of very relevant and useful information to help everybody who has possibly damaged their phone. So thank you guys so much for watching. My name is Erica, and I will be seeing you guys in another review. Bye!